Those are the obviously the two teams that are right behind you in the standings, third and fourth. So just talk a little bit about you know how important it is to kind of get two points from both of them. And well, uh, first of all, I'm not worried about Buffalo. I won't worry about Buffalo until after the game on Friday night, win or lose. You know, uh, uh, everyone thinks it's a cliche, but you got to worry about one hockey game at a time, and it's so important. And uh, we'll watch a little bit of tape of uh, Fredonia, and uh, uh, they've had uh, some great success in this rink over the years. So they're going to come in here, play hard, probably try to slow the game down a little bit, but uh, we're going to have our work cut out for us, uh, um, and, and we must be ready for a battle for sure. Yeah, I mean, they've been on a roll a little bit as, as of late the last four games, I think. I mean, just talk about kind of what you'll be you'll be watching for with them. Well, I, I think the key to any team is uh, getting on a roll is getting good goaltending. I heard they began much more goaltending and playing good defense. And, uh, the only way you can beat good defense is playing good, de good defense yourself. So we got to play uh, the game hard, uh, play our style of the game, which is get it in deep uh, and keep it simple, and uh, make sure when it does get in our rim, play good defense. One of the best ways to play good defense is to stay out of the box, because even if you give up uh, penalty killing goals or not, you still give the team a lot of momentum when you put them on the power play. Okay. First of all, I just want to talk about this weekend. I mean. You got your your last two home regular season games coming up. I mean, as a senior, is that something that's in the back of your mind at all? all that you know, uh, got a few, maybe just a few chances left to play in this building. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a tough one to leave, but at the same time, it's it's been a good go of four years. And I mean, coming in, playing in this barn is awesome. The, the crowd's awesome, the atmosphere is, is great. The fans are great, but uh, at the same time, you got to get the two points. And, Make it a good feeling time to get that moment, but, um, Right, and, and I know you guys don't like to look ahead much. I mean, you've got Fredonia first, but then, you know, on Saturday is, is Buffs Day, and that's obviously the only SUNYAC team that has beaten you this season. I mean, is that something that you guys will be thinking about a little bit and trying to make sure, you know, that they don't get the season sweep? Um, we look at one game at a time, <laughs> try and get the first two points against Fredonia, and then worry about Saturday, but, yeah, we, we always want to play Buffs Day. It's always a good game. And, like our coach always said, they play like they have five goalies on the ice. They block a lot of shots, and, and we got to get away from that and try and get shots on net and win that game and win battles. I mean, when you go into a game knowing that you've got a, a team like that that's going to block a lot of shots, does that change, you know, as a forward, your shot selection or where you put shots? Or uh, you definitely got to uh, shoot past, got to shoot around the guy, you got to fake the shot and try and go around him. things like that. Try and do the little things you can't. Can't take slap shots and let them hit, hit them all the time. 